The biggest asset deals on Fabs has now begun with their Black Friday sale. And as someone who loves Ninja Bear Studio and the gameplay ability system, it would be completely horrible for me not to tell you that all their assets are 30% off, except for this one because it's free. So you're probably thinking, why gas? Well, the gameplay ability system has been battle tested with games like Smite 2, and even Fortnite utilizes gas as well. And plugins like Ninja Bear Studio makes it easy for us indie developers or even teams to utilize gas to its full extent. All their plugins are a whopping 30% off, and it's very rare for Ninja Bear Studio to have any discounts, and I believe this will be the only one until next Black Friday. So why is Gameplay Ability System the best way to go when developing an Unreal Engine? Well, Gameplay Ability System is built to handle single player and multiplayer scenarios seamlessly. It automatically manages server authority, client prediction, and replication, saving time when building multiplayer features. Ninja Bear Studio has made really extensive documentation for us to look into and learn exactly how the system works inside and out. So there are step-by-step -step tutorials as well if you go under Guides, Showcase, and currently they've released Part 1, which goes from configuring all your plugins, configuring your gameplay ability system, to creating melee weapons, attacks, combos, finishers, player damage, hit reactions, and so on. There are video tutorials as well as text on what to do step-by-step -step underneath. Gas promotes modularity by breaking down gameplay logic into abilities, effects, and attributes. This structure is easy to extend or modify, allowing developers to add new features without rewriting existing systems. Gas is also very optimized, and Epic has been working their way up through these updates in updating the gameplay ability system. Its attribute-based calculations and effect replication minimize the processing overhead, even in complex games with many active abilities and effects. GAS simplifies multiplayer development by handling replication for abilities and effects. Developers can focus on gameplay logic rather than worrying about the intricacies of syncing data between the client and server. GAS covers a wide range of gameplay mechanics including attributes such as health, mana, stamina, gameplay effects, and ability activation. If you're afraid to make your own C++ file and handle your own attribute stats, they even have this JSON data that you can simply just pour it in over and use the data table of these and adjust these how you want. And of course, I personally would recommend learning C++ when using anything gameplay ability system, actually anything Unreal Engine related, because C++ is just so much more extensive and modular than just regular Blueprint. But of course, time is very important when developing games, so take it with a grain of salt. Even the developers themselves make videos on how to use their own plugin, which is something I've never really seen on the Unreal Engine marketplace. I also have my own set of tutorials for Ninja Bear Studios if you're interested in learning on a step-by-step -step basis. And together, we do cover a wide variety of what you need to know for Ninja Bear Studio. And one of my favorite things about Ninja Bear Studio is that they're even battle testing their own plugins in their own game that they're working on. They have a very active Discord community that's in the description below for you to see, and there are a lot of people willing to help you out on whatever problems you may come across. You can even look back on their forums just to see if you want to learn anything in particular, such as how to set up inventory or how to set up some ragdoll effects. If you don't want to take my word for it, then just listen to Unreal Engine or Epic themselves. They've featured and showcased Ninja Bear Studios twice in a row now. This plugin has been making strides across UE devs because it utilizes gameplay ability system, which is inspired by concepts from Lyra and other projects created by Unreal Engine themselves. One thing I like about Ninja Bear Studios is that I don't have to reinvent the wheel with every single project that I create. So for example, if I just head over to my content browser and look up Blueprint and let's just type in Ninja, you'll see that it already comes with a lot of predefined blueprints such as the combat cast actor, it handles inventory pickup, and just so many things such as our player actor, player pawn, player state, combat, weapon man, all these components that are already modular for us to use and just work with in order to make a replicated game. And the list goes on and on and on. If you're like me, you've spent countless hours tackling the gameplay ability system in Unreal Engine, trying to implement features that can be overwhelming or time consuming. That's where Ninja Bear Studios plugins have transformed how I approach game development. These plugins are nothing short of revolutionary. They save me thousands of hours of work from creating systems from scratch. Whether it's core mechanics, ability frameworks, or scalable gameplay features, the Ninja Suite provides tools that are modular, powerful, and most importantly, easy to integrate. What sets Ninja Bear Studio apart is their commitment to modularity and scalability. Unlike some marketplace systems that are tailored toward their own specific games, limiting your creative scope, Ninja Bear Studios tools are designed to be adaptable for any type of game you want to create. You're not boxed into a predefined structure or forced to work around limitations. Ninja Bear Studios built their plugin to empower your creativity and not stifle it. In fact, using their plugins has made me a much better Unreal Engine developer. 
Why? Because instead of relying on a one-size-fits-all solution, Ninja Bear's approach teaches you how to leverage the power of Unreal's core systems like gameplay ability system to their fullest potential. You learn the why behind the design and not just the how. You can easily look into the C++ files for some great documentation and learn how to code properly. For anyone starting on a new project or looking to speed up their workflow, I cannot recommend the Ninja Suite enough. Whether you're working on a single player RPG, multiplayer shooter, RTS games, or something entirely unique, their tools give you the perfect foundation to focus on your vision rather than the grunt work. In short, Ninja Bear Studios is more than just a plugin provider. It's a game development partner. And if you're serious about making high quality games and saving yourself countless of hours in development time, this is the toolkit you need. And I know getting the whole suite might be a little expensive, but it's way, way, way cheaper than just hiring a developer to do this groundwork for you. Thanks for watching Code of the Rope. Like, subscribe, comment below what you want to see next, and I'll see you in their Discord and in the comment section of my tutorials. Thanks for watching.